morning. We're here at uh, Saturday morning, February 27th. Uh, we're here at our milepost 8 uh, siding. And I put up, uh, want to give you a, a follow-up story on this uh, bad bearing here. I put up a video, if you haven't watched it, on uh, another bad order car with bad uh, wheel set bearing. If you want to go back and watch that video if you haven't seen it already but I want to give you a little follow-up uh, on that on that video uh, I was coming up track there yesterday and found part of the rest of the story found this alongside the uh, on the shoulder um, so I wanted to show you this piece it's pretty ugly it's uh, seen some uh, a lot of heat <laughs> Wow, um, this uh, this particular piece here, um, I don't know the exact name for it. It could be called an inner uh, race. I'm not sure the exact term of what you would call this, but this the axle went in here. Uh, this uh, this went around, and then your your roller bearings went in the, went in here. Of course, they all disintegrated. Uh, they're they're nowhere to be found. They're lost in the ballast. So I wanted to show you this. This is not something that uh, very many people get to see. Uh, <laughs> and I don't like to see it either because, uh, but, uh, it, but it does happen. It does happen. And I uh, wanted to show that to you. I've had some, uh, if you go back and watch that other video uh, I was telling you there earlier about, um, it's a lot of really interesting comments on on that video and uh, one of the uh, discuss topics of discussion was why don't we grease these bearings well these are sealed bearings and uh, even though there's a, a grease fitting there I call that a, I call it a button head fitting it may have other terms than that while you're looking at it, look at that lock plate around uh, there that holds those cap screws on there and then the little tabs here that uh, go against the get the uh, keep the caps cap screws tight but uh, they used to be able to grease these bearings and uh, as far as I know all the bearings now are sealed so you can't grease them so this you really can't grease that bearing uh, my theory why these end caps still have those uh, grease fittings on them and we've got several cars that do and we've got a bunch of cars that don't have grease fittings and my theory is when they rebuilt uh, these uh, wheel sets that uh, they either found that the uh, bearing was okay and they didn't replace it or if they did replace the bearing they just put the old end cap back on rather than going through the expense of buying a new end cap with no grease fitting. But that's my theory. Uh, <laughs> and I could be proven wrong. And I, uh, one, another uh, topic of discussion is where are these bearings made? Uh, as far as I know, they're all uh, Timken bearings or Hyatt bearings. And uh, while Hyatt's no longer in business, they have uh, were sold to... Uh, General Motors way back in the 1916 and then General Motors sold that part of it to uh, General Bearing if I'm correct anyway both Timken and General Bearing are uh, international companies and uh, you really can't find any information on where they actually manufacture the bearings so they these bearings could be made in the USA. They could be made in China. I have no clue where they're made. Anyway, uh, it's a lot, a lot nicer out here uh, this morning than uh, the last time I made this video. It was 19 degrees and everything was everything was all white, and uh, I was cold. <laughs> I was cold that morning, so. Uh, it's 40 degrees here this morning. I'm liking this a whole lot better. Okay, I'm waiting on a train to come through. 
I'm going to go up here and start my tamper up and I'm going to follow the train out and get a little tamping done today. I have been, everything's been froze up and uh, haven't had a chance to do much tamping here in the last couple months. So I got a lot of catch up to do. Uh, we're going to get some rain, but anyway, thank you very much for watching. And I uh, hope you have enjoyed this video. And I really do appreciate all the wonderful comments that you guys send in. So have a really good day and happy rails to you my friends until we meet again someday i'm going to sing that song for you i'm not that brave yet <laughs> okay